I asked 100 people to give me random eggs for my Nuzlocke, and the results were amazing. In a traditional Nuzlocke, your first encounter on any new route is the only Pokemon you could catch. But in this video, as soon as I step onto a new route, I'm allowed to hatch a new egg. And if my Pokemon faints, then I have to release it, and if I wipe in any battle, I lose my run. My goal in this video is to get past the second gym. Let's see if I can with the Pokemon you gave me. We have the lake encounter technically up there as well, and we have route one and then upcoming route two. So I could already have, including my starter, four eggs. Yeah, I totally didn't know how to capture a Pokemon. Thank you for my balls though. That's what, exactly what I needed. Oh, our first egg's already hatching. Here we go. All right. I guess we could claim this is our starter Pokemon. Who is the first one on the team? Yo, a shiny Charizard? What if you guys are spoiling me? Hello? Okay, there we go. We got our next egg. What else did you guys give me? Is this another good one? It's an electrode. Who gave me an electrode? I have a feeling we're about to have explosion up the wazoo here. At least it knows Swift. What do we get? What do we get? Dun, 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 dun. Give me something juicy. What is it? Ma ah! All right, GG. How am I? If I lose this series, if this, if I lose at any point, I'm I, I should I should I need to retire Pokemon. I feel like right. I, I deserve to get roasted if I lose this run. I have a modest Charizard and a modest Mewtwo. Okay, that's our last egg. Who's the last member of our beautiful team? Oh, it's a Talo. Okay, we got a little Talo. It's, we got a, a, a normal, an actual normal Pokemon. Some sort of like orb item to help it out big time. So three of my Mons are actually really useful. You're definitely a Sackmon Electrode, you useless ball. Let's get these puppies leveled up and get ready for the uh, playthrough. And every encounter going forward, I get to just simply pick up a new egg and hatch it. And the way I'm going to go about this egg lock is I will never change the attacks you guys gave the Pokemon. The only situation I'll change the attacks in is if I need the HMs to progress in the game, but that's it. I'm more curious about what the gym leaders are going to have. Gym leaders and trainers could be a big issue for me. All right, our first trainer. What's our first trainer going to be like? Azrael? Oh, you poor, poor baby Pokemon. Oh, no. This is going to be very unfortunate for you. We'll just discharge. Oh, yeah. You're not a water type yet. But you only know Splash. This is, su th I re this is such an unreal run so far. Out of the 100 eggs I could have chosen, I genuinely picked a shiny Mewtwo, shiny Charizard, a cute Talo, and whatever the f*** Electrode wants to be. That thing is just there to blow up one day. That's it. That's it. We have technically one, two, three encounters, not including the caves. I could include the caves, actually. Oh, hold on. Hold the phone. If I pick up this fishing rod, I actually have a lot of encounters I could go through right now. We have one encounter there, one to the north of me, plus the cave that makes it two, the route to the right of me, which is three. One, two, three, four, five. So we got a lot cooking here. Let's battle our uh, homie. And we'll go to the gym. And I'll go up to the other cave. So at least I could say I've made it to those locations. And then I could go pick up the eggs. Oh, you have a Flareon. Well, this is awkward. I just threw my fire type against your fire type. You know, maybe this is a Dragon Rage scenario. I think this is totally a Dragon Rage scenario. Yeah, that's ridiculous. Uh, level five. What the f***? <laughs> What are these Pokemon you guys gave me? There's no... I, did I get more like this? Why did that... Why did Flareon just give me a juicy amount of experience? That was crazy. That actually was crazy. All right. Easy money. Our rival was useless in this scenario, dude. Sorry, Nolan. Oh, you lost. Thank you for your $900. Okay. So by all technicality, we walk by this guy. He gives us Rock Smash. And now we would have gotten the, the right side encounters. So all I needed to do is go quickly up north and 
we technically would have been to each encountered area. So we'll pick up the egg shortly. Oh! Yo! We got a free Pokemon! <laughs> we got an old Amber! That's uh, Aerodactyl's... What the f***? What? Are there cameras? Somebody manipulating the code while I play this game right now? What is going on? I'm just trying to go up to the cave without these uh, trainers yet, okay? I just want my Pokemon first. Boom! Technically encounter happened. Whoa! Now we get to just go back and get our eggs. I'm. S this is what I've been waiting for. So those are my five eggs. Let's see if we can hatch them real quick. Yo, a Blaziken? I think a lot of you guys have been nice to me so far. Jolly nature. Brave bird, brick break, quick attack, and you could have given it blaze kick, but I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. Who is this one? Cam, Edlo, Dark. Who was it? Who was it? What is it? Hey, a shiny whooper? Look at that cute little fella. <laughs> a whooper with earthquake and water pulse, sludge bomb, and muddy water? Yo! This little guy's kinda, kinda crazy. I might keep Wooper. What the hell? <laughs> it kinda makes me nervous that these other eggs are taking quite a while to hatch. Oh, there we go. Maybe I'm speaking too soon. Cause usually if they're taking a while to hatch, like they're cracked Pokemon, right? A uh, Miss Drevis. Okay, we're getting more normal here now. All right, you know, Wooper into Miss Drevis. Calm Mind, Trick Room, Payback, and Shadow Ball. That's a very interesting move pool but at least i have a ghost type now like i'm getting good variation here already with like a couple of these pokemon they're very useful i don't think i'm gonna evolve uh whooper though is this dark or is this edlo what do we get what do we get what do we get we got guys <laughs> what a... this is unreal Modest! Ah! Uh, this is what we got? This is what we got? Hold! Wait for it! Wait for it! A Mime Junior! Look at that little fella! Look at that little clown! I'll punch it! In a cute way! Gives full immunity to all sound mimic fling tickle and fake out. I guess that's where the balance starts kicking in, huh? <laughs> Let's head on over to the first gym leader right now. We're pretty much just going to be using Charizard and Mewtwo to begin with anyways. Because now this is where things get a bit more interesting. Once I get to the gym leader, I am going to have to limit myself to three Pokemon. Because the way that I, the little rules work for this egg lock, I am only allowed to use the certain number of Pokemon depending on the amount the gym leader has. So the first gym leader has three... I'm only going to be allowed to use three throughout that gym. That's going to add a little bit more balance to what we got going on right now too. But on top of that, the reason why I like that rule, it, it forces me to pick my like strongest three Pokemon and then, you know, strategize a bit. Hey, it, I got to bring a, a, a bad puppy in, but if I bring all the strong boys in and the gym leader has like one or two strong Pokemon, then I lose all the strong guys potentially, you know? I'm, all, I'm not allowed to be to their ace Pokemon, which, so my level cap is going to be level uh, 12 for my Pokemon, unless they naturally level up, which I think Charizard did already, 13, that's fine. So the three I'm going to bring in, let's think about this, I think I'm going to bring in three of the homies. Honestly, I am sorry, little fella. But you're getting benched too, Mewtwo, sit the f*** down. I don't want to lose you. You're actually my late game carry, I'm not even joking. We're going to need that Mewtwo as late as possible. I think Charizard's going to be perfectly fine for now. And you know what? You guys get to be level 12 as well. We can get Wooper to level 12. Earthquake and the other attacks aren't bad. And actually, Talos a very fast little guy. I do need to get him like poisoned or something. Maybe like fl Flame Orb? The first gym leader. What kind of Pokemon do you have in this randomizer? Please. Nothing too crazy, right? There's your three. I got my three. Starting off with a Honchkrow? Maybe Mewtwo with Discharge would have been way nicer here, but that's okay. We should be able to stab with Flamethrower and be totally fine. Totally fine, right? Kills? Maybe burns? Doesn't kill? But that's not even that much damage to me. That's 13. We're chilling. 
We could kill you with a fire spin. Never mind you. You, you potion. And I attack. My attack missed. Okay. It's fine. We're faster. Honchcrow is kind of like a beefy bird, dude. I don't think those bones are that hollow, dude. Electo uh, electric? Just a little electric dog? This is the level 14, so this is your ace? Alright, Charizard takes care of this easy sweep. Unreal. Unreal again, dude. And a Blaziken. Yeah, I actually have somebody. Justin, the perfect option for this. That's Wooper. That's a Wooper's job, baby. You handle the Blaziken, Wooper. Look at that thing. That thing won't scare you. Don't let that oversized chicken scare you, dude. Earthquake its ass. Yeah, he might crit you and kill you this next turn, but you kill him before that, right? Wooper? Right, little fella? Come on! Wooper? Wooper. Don't die. Wooper? Wooper? Good! Kill it! You did it, Whooper! Whooper's our lad! I didn't get to use Talo in this battle, but I mean, Charizard did all the heavy lifting, but I'm just excited that Whooper actually got to get used this battle. Okay, we are set up and we're ready to go. Uh, I think we're going to lead with Mewtwo right now. And our goal is to get to the next gym. Should be nice and quick. We can get to the second gym leader. We have to go through the forest. Oh, wait a minute. We actually have an item above me. And technically a new encounter. Ah. And wait a minute. The cave below me where we went to the get the gym leader is also another encounter. We can hatch two more eggs. Hold the phone, JP. A spirit tomb. Oh, one hatch instantly. That was instant. Uh-oh. What is this? What did you give me? A wheezing? That's our second explosion Pokemon of the run. We also have Pain Split, Gyro Ball, and Mimic. You're actually useless. Wobbler, what did you give us? What did you give us, homie? Come on. Give me something uh, that I want to use. Something cute. Something good. Ooh, shiny Glide Score. That's... Actually, the first time I've seen Shiny Gliscor, that's one really cool looking Pokemon. I'm not going to lie. I love the Shiny variant of that. What? Yo, that was my Pog face in full action. Earthquake, Guillotine, that's kind of whatever. But Earthquake, Wing Attack with Swords Dance, and you're kind of like a defensive Pokemon naturally. That's a good guy. That's a juicy one. I might want to use that uh, instead of Darkrai, I won't lie. I might keep Darkrai, like, on the fence a little bit. I don't know. Maybe I'll keep... Maybe I keep Gliscor out, too. Like, Gliscor's another really late-game Pokemon, to be honest. We got a little battle up ahead right here. It's not any important people from Team Plasma, so we're, I'll hold back. But I think I am just gonna sweep with Mewtwo real quick with Dawn, right? Like, these, these guys are not anything to worry about. All right, Grunt Steelix! And a Venusaur! Actually... <laughs> They're not bad Pokemon whatsoever. All right, we'll do this. Oh, sh imagine if I clicked A. That zoom into that. What if I clicked A there? It would have been a two v one. Danger zone. I just know you're a poison type, so that's a one shot. And then you could go ahead and high jump kick Steelix, which is also super effective. And that's teamwork, baby. <laughs> Meditate. Why? Why? Now be useful next time, Don. I could I should have psychic your ass. I should have. I I I did a 2v1. 1v2. Well, you, you get what I mean. You're making me mad, Don. Do something next time. Yellow shard? Not bad. I think we've reached an instance though where we actually need rock smash. Mm, I didn't think about this. I'm sorry, Wooper. You do need to be nerfed, little guy. <laughs> I'm nerfing Wooper with Rock Smash. Okay, we made it to Floroma Town. And uh, we need to go save this child's father. But before we do that, let's... I mean, before we actually go and uh, save the father, let's pick up the encounter. So by all technicalities, I could fish right here to get one encounter. And I go to Valley here and we get this encounter as well. 
Ooh, with a big mushroom. All right, guys, what did you give me? Pan and Danny. Hopefully it's something good. Is this Pan's egg or is this Danny's egg? What'd you get me? What'd you get me? It's like a Christmas present. Oh, a dragon air. Yo, I'd actually save this for uh, later in the game. That's amazing because Dragonite is one of my favorites. Dragon dance, dragon pulse, and hydro pump. Okay, it's a special attacking one. <coughs> I mean, it's something. That is going to be kind of painful. At least I could rain dance to hydro pump, maybe? Like, that might be a combination. Who knows? And I get the stab with Dragon Pulse regardless. Danny, what did you get me, good sir? Come on, Danny. Come on, Danny. Something juicy? Something good? I'm out of my seat? Yo! A shiny Gengar! That's actually awesome. I always hated shiny Gengar because you could barely tell the difference between shiny and normal, but... Gengar himself, as a timid as well, is huge! Wow. Why? 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 I I can't even put it to sleep. I Why did you give it Thunder Punch and not Thunderbolt? And why Explosion? I don't want this. I don't... Take it back. Where's the receipt? I want to refund this guy. So before I could run up into Team Gala... Oh my god, did I say Team Plasma last time? Team Galactic. Before I can run into Team Galactic's headquarters and just fight the first commander, I'm going to treat the commander like a gym battle. I know it's not, but I believe she has three. It might be four. It actually might be four Pokemon. I just know in a vanilla run, it's normal. It's uh, normally a per ugly that's just very terrifying and spooky this early in the game. So I'm trying to just remember if it was three or four because I don't want to go in with four when they might have three. Let's go straight for the commander. I believe you have four Pokemon, Commander. I hope you do. If you only have three, this is going to be very awkward for me. Please. Please, please, please. It was two! Where am I getting my information from? Oh my god. Well, I have to use Wooper, and I'm only allowed to switch. I, I would have brought Mewtwo in, truthfully. I wouldn't have brought Wooper in. It would have been Mewtwo and Wooper. Fudge. Wooper, this thing's super effective against you, pal. I'm going to switch out. I'm only allowed to use you and Mewtwo, though, so. Hopefully, I don't go to sleep right now or some sh Oh, it was Mega Drain. Thank goodness I switched out. I don't want to lose Wooper this early. I really don't. I want to take Wooper all the way. Alright, I think that's the first thing of damage Mewtwo's finally taken, dude. What was the other Pokemon from this uh, commander then? Is it still technically per... Oh, I mean, it would what, it would have been per ugly. What level is per ugly? 16? Rhyperior? Was it level 16? Level 17. All right, so I'm not over-leveled, at least. We, we're fine on that aspect. Aura Sphere is going to be super effective, but I do think your HP stat is high enough at this point, and you're one level above me. I don't think this is a kill. I don't know what... I, I, clearly, I don't know what I'm talking about. I was wrong about the number of Pokemon that this commander has, and uh, I was clearly wrong about your HP stat. What am I f saying, dude? Jesus. All right, we got our first double battle, Cheryl. This is going to be a problem here, buddy. We got to take this carefully, okay? Please. You and your hippo is going to carry me. They got a Roselia and a Kakuna. I need you to take care of the Roselia, actually. Please. And please don't hate me either, Cheryl. Don't turn your hip, your wild hippo on me. Because the hippo might be taking some friendly fire here now. Oh, sh**. Oh, sh**. Is that hitting both of us? Roselia, please. Not my whooper. Wooper, no! There's an exit. I'm so relieved. You're welcome, Cheryl. I only lost my f***ing Wooper because of you. I don't want to speak to you ever again. Get out! Cheryl upsets me. So, we already got Route 205. We have a turn of cave, the cave to the right. And we also have the good old handy dandy route as well. There's an item there, too. Technically, I can get an encounter in this town because there's a pool of water... So that's one, two, three eggs to go through. But we must first salute. I was going to take you all the way, Wooper. And honestly, I could have. 
if I just wasn't such a dumbass and left you out against Roselia to Mega Drain your ass. I thought you could have lived. I thought you had better special defense. But I forget you're a Wooper and you need to evolve that. But anyways, thank you for your service, Wooper. Taylor will take the reign now. You have now passed the torch to Taylor. Thank you, Wooper. <laughs> we lost Wooper. And it's only it's only my fault. I, I I'm the only one to blame. So yeah, I would have pretty much you know, used my fishing rod here for an encounter. This is an encounter within itself. We got a luck incense. Nice. And the cave is also an encounter. Let me go in the cave. Let me go into the cave. Ah! Every time with these damn hikers! What is it? What is the beefed up egg gonna be like? What the f*** is going on this run? Why are you giving- I mean, it's still gonna be very good. It is still gonna be very good, don't get me wrong. But why are you giving me a special attacking Pokemon that's adamant nature, brother? I, I, I still appreciate the shiny Dioxys. What is it? My favorite f Pokemon. This is the one f***ing Pokemon plushie I have in my life. It's my favorite f Pokemon. I wanted to use this. I wanted to use it. Why would you give me something I can't use? Explosion? Scary face? Thrash? Dude. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. What is it? Please. 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 What is it? What is it? Oh! A shiny Heracross? Yo, egg locks are fun. This is so fun to see what you guys are giving me. It's like, it's like a slot machine, right? Yo, my friend. Hello. 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 You are on the team. Yeah, we're gonna go into this gym battle with Heracross, uh... Halo and Charizard. Heracross has now made it to the team. Can we get a pa Can we get like a round of applause? Thank you. Thank you. Heracross is kind of a big guy and a big addition to the team. He's also a cute mother... All right. After doing some extensive research as well, <clears throat> it seems that the next gym leader has three Pokemon and they're level 20 to 22. So we're going to level all our guys up to level 20 to fit that, that whole scenario. And uh, we're going to get rid of... Actually, no Mewtwo, because we're going to keep that instead of Deoxys. Honestly, I want to keep Charizard too. Charizard's not bad. We'll use Deoxys instead of Charizard. And we'll put you on the bench as well, Tauros. And we got to level up the rest of the guys now. So we'll level them up and go right into the gym battle, honestly. Hello, Gardenia. It's time to face my wrath. What Pokemon do you have? You don't have, like, a Garatina or something, right? Oh, a Hypno! Yeah, Shadow Ball is going to be beautiful against this, actually. Hello! Hell, even Heracross leading would have been beautiful for this. One, like, one bug attack and that thing's dead. I think I have Bug Bite on Heracross. Oh, you actually are pretty tanky. What the hell, Hypno? You know, I don't actually know much about Hypno stats and all that shit. The only thing I know is that Hypno would kidnap children in Pokemon Fire Red. You weird Pokemon. Alright, Hypno's taken care of. Ludicolo. Honestly, uh, what are your attacks like? Bug Bite? Oh, you have Aerial Ace too. You're definitely going Heracross instead of Taylor right now. Because I think we could go Bug Bite, and that should be super effective. Also, Shiny Heracross is like the perfect level of pink. I like it a lot. Yeah, that is super effective. Bug is super effective against uh, Grass. Wait, did I have a Citrus Berry? What does that do? Is that going to kill me? That was a lot of damage. I won't lie. I don't want to miss my attack either. Hey, come on. Is it dead? Close, but no, no cigar. We ain't missing. We ain't missing. We outspeed the Ludicolo anyways. It's too busy doing this happy dance. Last but not least is Psyduck. Oh, Taylo. Taylo, this is all you, buddy. This is all you, buddy. F*** up the duck. Or as I like to say, f*** duck. Aerial Ace? How much damage is that actually going to do, though? Psyduck isn't 
too tanky, right? Water gun? You could take a water gun, Taylo. You can't take a water gun, Taylo. I'm a little nervous. Um, that's definitely stab. I, uh, you, 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 you're taking too much damage for my liking. Just don't get crit here. Don't get crit. You outspeed. You out. Don't get crit. Don't get crit. I'm closing my eyes. That was scary. I, I, I couldn't close my eyes on that one. That was a little too close for comfort. I won't lie. But it's okay. You still come out on top, Taylo. Just like I predicted. And you level up, pal. That's, that, that's my Taylo. Easy dub, easy win. We got the forest badge. Easy dub, easy win. We got the forest badge. Yeah. We've beaten the first two gym leaders, given birth to a lot of eggs, and even taken down the first Team Galactic admin, but I'm having a blast with this egg lock, and I hope you are too. So the next Pokemon video will be a continuation, and I hope you all enjoy seeing everything that comes of it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Let's go.